Let's simplify the fraction 25 over 125. So this is 25 125 To do that, what we want to do is find another fraction that's equivalent to 25 divided by 125. It has the same decimal value. It's just that we've simplified 25 over 125 down to its lowest terms. So to do that, we need to find a common factor, something that goes into 25 and 125 evenly, a whole number. It turns out that 25, it'll go into 125 five times. So if we divide 25 by 25, we get one. If we divide 125 by 25, we get five. So we can simplify the fraction 25 120 fifths down to one fifth. We can't simplify this any further. And these are equivalent fractions. If you divide 25 by 125, or one by five, you'll get the same decimal, 0 0.2. That's because they're equivalent fractions. We've just reduced 25 125 fifths down to 1 fifth. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.